DT Abubakar's mobilization tour of the Southwest has been in Ogun State for a while. Ogun has shown strong support as DT meets more people. Apparently, Ogun has a strong governorship candidate, Belonia philanthropist, they simply call Lado. The deputy governorship candidate, a princess and strong religious leader. Some of the people say this is a winning team. Recently, Titi Abubakar has focused her message on voting correctly on the ballot. The PDP would not need any void votes. When the time comes for voting, they should all be there at the polling booth. They will register their names, then they will vote, they will cast their vote. And if they want to vote, they should not use their tongue, but they should use their pointer. Because the tongue can soil the paper, and that paper will be void. Your vote will not be counted. Governorship candidate Oladi Kuko Adebutu tells the people why the PDP should be voted. He accuses the ruling government of dividing the country and ruining the economy, allegations the APC government has been denying. We adopted global leadership. Ogalopa, Awusa, Ogami. Awusa, Oga GSS, Awusa, Oga, 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 We want a united country. Uh, we deserve a united country. He supports that Atiku can make Nigeria work again. Your rights will not be trampled. Your businesses will be protected. Your assets will be protected. Everybody will come back. When everybody comes back, and we're all pushing and pulling in unison, we will get a successful nation again. Yes, that economy will start moving again. Yes, when that economy starts moving again, those jobs will come back. We are going to bring jobs back to this country. We are going to bring jobs back to the state. In Ponti Atiku Abubakar Sofuani, let's go to Nigeria working again. Some of the voters expect Atiku to immediately deal with unemployment and address social problems. Mass employment, first and foremost, because we have many graduates, useless and jobless graduates. Imagine the money the parents spent on these people to send it to the most expensive university. At the end of the day, they are at home doing nothing. So if they can consider their own force and woman empowerment, then I think they are going to be the best for us. They will lie for us today, they will last tomorrow. So we don't need government that will be lying to Nigerians. This is uh, Abasha Luta. They are collecting money. People, they collect money from APC. We don't know what, where the money enter. The campaign train has more grounds to cover, and it's urgent. Here I'm looking at you. Go to news.